Welcome back to my foot quest one, two, th three here. Today we're going to continue playing um, Hogwarts Legacy. So I actually have noticed that at first my videos aren't getting a lot of views. And I think... Correctly, I've wrong. You, you guys actually haven't got the notification bell on. Like, it's perfectly fine, just... If you want to see live videos... Remember to keep that notification bell on. It's not working. Okay, then. So, first, let's talk to Ominous. I, I think I heard one. <laughs> Dark mermaids find us that interesting. Ah, based on all the chatter when you entered the common room, I'm guessing you're the new fifth year. I'm Ominous. Ominous Gaunt. Nice to meet you, Ominous. Well, you certainly had a memorable arrival. Well, if I'm going to make my mark here, I had to start right away. <laughs> you're definitely in the right house. Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here, though I doubt you'll need it. Did that this student say he thought he heard a mermaid? <laughs> yes, but I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along, though. Been known to keep some first years on the lookout for hours. <laughs> I feel Thank bad. You, very nice to meet you. Pleasure was all mine. Don't be a stranger. If you do that, you'll lose. Um, Trust I me. guess next we should talk to Sebastian, which is right here. That? Can I help you? Oh, you're the new fifth year. I'm Sebastian Sallow. Welcome to Slytherin. Thank you. Thank Not everyone you. has a ministry escort to school. He was a friend of Professor Figs, who merely joined us for the ride. Still, impressive. Dreadful way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Fig are all right. Professor Fig and I were lucky to escape with our lives. Yeah, Indeed. that is true. And how did you escape? It's all still a bit of a blur, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. Okay. What book were you reading? A spell book I picked up. Has a few interesting things, but not exactly what I was looking for. I'm sure you'll find out soon enough. But not every spell you may need can be found in our assigned textbooks. Are you saying some spells aren't taught at Hogwarts? Which ones? Seems I may have met a kindred spirit. <laughs> that is a conversation for another time. It was good meeting okay. you. Good luck today. Thank you. If you do that, you'll lose. Trust me. <laughs> Not going to move there, are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I didn't warn you. Checkmate. Told you. You should have listened to me. Ah, oh, I know who you are. You're the new Slytherin, the one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic on your first day, taking all the attention away from the first day. Oh, yeah. I'm Amelda, by the way. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills on a broom are legendary. Okay. Yeah, we, we had it handled. 
And I think you're underestimating the nature of a dragon. A broom would have been kindling. <laughs> <laughs> Not the way I fly. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can teach you more than Kagawa ever could. Speaking of which, I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. Goodbye, Mother. Right. Nice meeting you. Is the new fifth year Slytherin in here? Professor Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. Okay. Wait, I wonder what... I reckon that... Good morning. I I'm pretty sure for your first day Professor Weasley would be in Gryffindor. Can't believe I'm here. But well, I'm not entirely sure. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Really? What is it? Here you are. It's just a book. <gasps> oh, it literally just broke. Come on. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. Okay. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Yeah, that makes sense. Wait, what? What's the point on pretending to put in my pocket? Pocket if I can just make it disappear. Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me, and we shall put it to the test. This way. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. Why do we have to be so slow? The guide slow? will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. Do keep up! Why don't you cast Revelio on that statue? And see what details the field guide can provide. Rebellion. Okay. You. Okay. Field guides. Each right. Exit field guides. Clever, isn't it? <laughs> Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. Oh, really? Is this it? actually? Yeah, it makes sense. It's what I is just extra homework. Wow. Well, at least it's optional. Timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use blue flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Open map. Yeah, I just like how it kind of does that. Of course, it's divided into two main areas. The left side of the map is where students and professors live. And it includes the house coming rooms and the great hall. So like the graves. Okay. In this view you can see the flute flute paints available in that region uh, yeah, we get it. The right side of the map is where you click 
go like Professor Weasley has unlocked the central hole for times for you. Time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. I can never get it. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Always something happening here. It's like the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. Okay. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Okay. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. More hard work? by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Sounds like this. Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh. Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, oh, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Yes, I will only probably have time for one more question. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit chat. I need to get to class myself. Might okay. I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And okay. invaluable to me. As I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? You I did, my best, But I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more Literally, anybody can with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle proof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map?
I reckon we can do that first. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. So now we don't need the mini map and it's supposed to be much more immersive. Look at that wall burst there. Yes, at the start it's a lot of dialogue, sadly. Just character development. Sorry if you guys don't put me. Sorry, basic. Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces in your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the Great Poacher Raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Couldn't you just you cast this character? Of how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. That's to the wise, age asking. matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso. A levitation charm. Levioso! <laughs> a surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Reasonable. Okay. Now we've got to do this mini game again. Don't worry, eventually these do get kind of harder because you need to press different buttons. Levioso. Yes, let's go! Now, let's try something a little larger. Okay. The magic would be so handy. Let us begin with a basic cast. <laughs> See how the dummy deflected your cast. Yeah. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprised opponent is a weak opponent as Master Pruitt so artfully helped me demonstrate earlier. Now, well done. Yes! <laughs> Very good, but the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start <gasps> with you two. Duelists, take your mark. <gasps> Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I'm going to begin the first foot quest. Basic cost. And Protego, you may begin. This should be easy. <laughs> Nothing lucky about it. I know. Protego, stupid Protego. This can't be your first duel. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. <laughs> Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. <laughs> what does that even mean? Like maybe it. I put you it possibly on the spot means like and you rose to the challenge. 
points to Slytherin. Thank you, guys. Glad to have the Give opportunity to practice. Something if as good as you get it. any indication, we can expect Which great is. things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelow's entirely. Understood, Professor. Okay. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done. Okay, I'll probably do a like the assignment and stuff off camera, just because, All like. Right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. They really are just grinding. Nice work. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was and quite it would something. take like three parts about it. of it was grinding. Good practice. practice? Felt more like I was dueling an expert. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. In fact, it was. Perhaps I have a knack for it. Be coy if you like, but I know better. Magic requires intention and talent. You know, Thank you. you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Oh, yeah. Exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. <laughs> if you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club, or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank yeah. you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure have you got to be clever you. enough sure not soon. to get Perhaps caught? Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck, or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Till next time. That actually like looks so dark and so cool. Yep, so how much time have we got left? Yeah, so I reckon that might be the end of this video. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure Ooh, that's a lot. Make sure to have the notification bell on if you want it's on. Just really helps my channel grow to be honest and like every subscriber kinda of needs a lot for me. So anyway, peace out and goodbye for now.